St. Pete now has electric scooters. A launch was delayed because of the pandemic, but the scooters are now ready for residents and visitors to ride. 10 Tampa Bay's Madison Oliver took them out for a spin and learned what is the difference about this program compared to Tampa's electric scooters. Sometimes it makes sense to take your time. Let's see what others are doing. Let's learn from the things they did right and the things they did wrong. If you visit downtown St. Pete, you will now see these guys. This is our Razor Share Eco Smart model. Um, we're thrilled to have it here in St. Petersburg, Florida. Razor and VO e scooters became available for rent today. One of the big differences you'll notice right away with these St. Pete scooters is not only that they have seats, which is very comfortable, by the way, but that when you want to park them, you have to park in one of these corrals. Which helps with safety, traffic, hopefully avoiding some of the sim similar situations that maybe some other areas may have faced with scooters kind of being everywhere. If you try to park them somewhere else, you won't be able to, meaning you just keep getting charged for the ride until you find a parking corral. Another restriction? There are areas called no ride zones where if our customers approach it, uh, the scooter will slow down to uh, almost a complete stop. That includes areas like the pier. The scooters are supposed to be driven on the street, not the sidewalk. And if you want to take it easy at first, you can start with an education mode where the average speed will be uh, eight miles. With seats and the option for slower speeds, St. Pete hopes that this will not just be a fun toy, but a real alternative for eco-friendly travel. What we've tried to do is to create an opportunity uh, for people of all ages and all comfort levels to get out of their cars uh, and use a different means of transportation to get around our downtown. I could see how the seat makes a big difference. It looks like fun either way. So you might recognize the name Razor. Yes, that is the same company that makes Razor scooters for your home. Both VEO and Razor have said that they are increasing cleaning on the scooters because of the ongoing pandemic.